You shouldn't be out here now. Come on, it's only a tunnel. Hey, what's up, everybody? It is Spider with FearNet at Fantastic Fest, and I am sitting here with the director and stars of Primal. This is about a group of uh, sexy young things that uh, go out looking for this uh, legendary Aboriginal cave painting. Uh, things go a bit pear-shaped when one of them takes takes a little bit of a midnight dip in a waterhole um, and becomes infected by something that makes her regress into a primal sort of predatory state. Just as the idea of this this sort of sexy woman growing these teeth and hunting her friends just um, somehow innately appealed to me. I had to figure out what I was going to do and how I was going to come across as some sort of scary thing when I'm not usually. We were physical and we got we got it into our voices and um, and then Will and I did quite a lot of impro and in our rehearsals. These guys sort of played around with in their sort of improv thing uh, various sort of animal traits and stuff and in the end we sort of backed it away from uh, because it, it tended to feel more like impersonating an animal. So still using the body uh, and the muscles that you know humans have, so physically behaving like a, um, in a way that made sense with the body, but in a very sort of regressive predatory animal state. I started with a growl mm. and then moved on from there. Normally you start with, you know, perhaps what you may intend to do with your life or what your goals are in life for the character. But this I just started with a growl and moved from there and became a physical role and I kind of started from with some sort of like groaning noise and into, I mean then I just started mucking around and screaming and screeching and then we just had to go for it when, yeah. when we were all actually filming it because we were in the bush and it was low budget and it was quick and there was lots of leeches and I got bruised and I got, I did all my own stunts so um, lots of jumps and, um, but the adrenaline is, meant, is crazy, I just loved it. But the film does have some elements of humour in it. Comedy and horror do sort of naturally go together in the same way that sex and horror go well together. It's sort of, they're, they're different in creating that polarity, I guess, in your audience's experience that actually the two enhance, can really enhance each other. Yeah, I mean, the, the hard thing with the comedy and horror is to hit the right tone. It was actually Will uh, during rehearsal, I think it was on the first day of rehearsal. Oh, sure. At an audition, I said, is this, uh, how much of a comedy is this? And you said, uh, just play it straight. It's not a comedy. The comedy will be there, it'll come out, but just play, play, play for what it is. Play the honesty of killing and murdering your friends. She's gonna come back first, we've gotta run. Okay, 